everybody. It's Jess here with Lush Jess. Thank you so much for watching for another weekly lunch video. So these are not fancy lunch videos. These are very simple and easy things I feed my kids. Um, today is Monday and it's their second week in their new school. So we're still kind of getting adjusted. But I thought I would show you and all the craziness behind me <laughs> what I pack for them for lunch today. Um... Every day I will show you what I pack for them and how much of it they eat. And like I said, these are just simple and quick things I could put together in the morning. Doesn't take a lot of time and it's stuff my kids actually like and will eat. Um, they have the opportunity to get lunch at school, but they prefer bringing their lunch. So anyway, let me show you guys what they have. It's always crazy in the mornings. This is real life. There's yelling going on. <laughs> anyway, let me show you guys what they have today. So we're starting out the week with one of their favorites, which is uh, pasta. So Nate has some white cheddar shells and cheese, and this is one's from Aldi. It's like the pasta roni, but it's the Aldi version. So I just primed his thermos with boiling hot water, dumped out the um, boiling water, put in the shells and cheese, and it should stay fairly warm in that. And then as a side, he has some Cheez-Its and a cereal bar. I just put it in this little container because if I put it, um, I've learned if I put like Cheez-Its or something in a Ziploc bag next to a thermos, it will crush it to a million pieces. And then he has a spoon. And of course, he likes to take milk with him on, um, <laughs> he likes to take milk with him uh, on for his lunch. I cannot even think straight. Okay, so he's got mac and cheese, cheese its cereal bar, and milk. And then I always send him a snack. So he has some potato chips and a juice squeezer thing. And I like to write them a note. So that is for Nate. All right, let's talk about Lucy. So she has, instead of the mac and cheese, she has uh, just plain spaghetti noodles. We had spaghetti last night, so we had some leftover. Plain spaghetti noodles, and then she has this little yum box. I love this little snack size yum box. It makes a great like little side item. So she has some watermelon, some peppers, and some honey nut Cheerios. And then she has her ice water that she takes during the day. She puts this at her desk and drinks on it all day. Of course, she has her fork for her lunch. And today I decided to give her a juice as well um, because sometimes she leaves this at her desk and then she doesn't drink anything during lunch. Um, so anyway, she has this mixed berry, uh, juice pouch from Aldi and she doesn't have snack time. They get home pretty early in the afternoon. So she'll have a snack when she gets home and she also has a note. So this is all their lunch and snacks for Monday. And we'll see you guys when they get home to see how they did. All right, you guys, kids are home from school. Let's see how they did. It's always noisy. Every time I turn the camera, um, Nate did great with his mac and cheese and his cereal bar and Cheez-Its. And he drank all of his milk and he also ate all of his snack. You guys, stop it. Um, Lucy said she didn't want her juice. So that's why I normally don't pack her one, but I did today and she didn't drink it. That's fine. We'll put it back in the fridge. And this is empty. I would show you all, but it's screwed on really tight. I can tell you every bit is gone. She told me that it was one of her friend's birthdays at school, so they had birthday cookies, so she didn't have time to eat everything. But she did pretty good. Um, just a little bit of watermelon and peppers left. So that's pretty good. I will give it a thumbs up for today. We'll see you guys back for Tuesday, coming up next. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Tuesday. Let me show you what the kids have for lunch today. Um, okay, so I did bagel bites for Nate. I'm hoping these are okay. They dried out a little bit on the bottom. Um, in the microwave. I have no idea why because I've done that before. They've stayed nice and soft. Anyway, I'm going to hurry and get this closed so hopefully it'll stay soft. But he has four bagel bites cut up here. He has been liking this, um, but it always makes me nervous because it is kind of like gushy and stuff. Anyway, <laughs> hopefully he likes this. He has a cereal bar, some sour cream and onion chips, and some strawberries. Um, and then that's his milk to go with it. For snack today, he has some Cheez-Its and a juice squeezy thing. For Lucy, she has a snacky lunch, so she has pepperoni, cucumber, grapes, animal crackers, chips, watermelon, and Fruit Loops. And then she has... Hello. Okay. And then she has um, her water to go with it. So this is what they have for Tuesday. And um, when they get home from school, of course, I will show you how much of this they ate. 
Um, I am making David's lunch today, so if you guys want to see that, I'll show you that next. All right, you guys, so this is what I'm sending with David. We had Chinese food yesterday, and we both ate about half of our food. So we put it together, and this is sesame chicken uh, with white rice and fried rice. And so that is a lot of food. Um, so I'm just giving him an apple with it. I will give him like a paper plate or something so he can heat it up because this is styrofoam. But anyway, he's also having a diet Dr. K, which is the Kroger knockoff of Diet Dr. Pepper. And that's what he's having for lunch. We do a lot of leftovers for lunch, if you haven't noticed. All right, you guys, so the kids are home from school. We're gonna see how they did today. Nate ate everything, even the bagel bites. So that is awesome. And he drank his milk. And let's see about Lucy. She just has some cucumber and one grape. So they, they did really good. Um, we'll see you guys back on Wednesday, coming up next. Hello everybody, today is Wednesday. There's a lot of commotion going on in the background as always, because we woke up uh, to snow this morning. So I think the kids are still going to school, but let me show you what they have for lunch today. So for Nate, I did some chicken nuggets, um, I just, I didn't put them in muffin cups today. I just left them in this little section. Cereal bar, chips, Cheez-Its, and ketchup. He has his milk to drink, a squeeze-it juice, and some potato chips for snack. Lucy has some ham rolls, um, animal crackers, goldfish, fruit loops, watermelon, carrots, and peppers, and she has her water. So this is what they're having today for Wednesday. We'll see you guys when they get home and see how they did. All right, you guys, kids are home from school. Let's see how they did. Lucy has, whoops, goldfish and some carrots. I have cold medicine everywhere because I have a cold. Um, allergies, actually, I think is what it is. Nate, Nate's killing it this week. He ate everything. So that's a very successful Wednesday. We'll see you guys back for Thursday coming up next. All right, you guys, welcome to Thursday. Here we go. Here is their lunch for today. Um, it's really dark outside, so it's not a lot of good light. I'm sorry about that. Um, so I did bagel pizzas again, for, or bagel bites again. This is the Aldi bagel bites for Nate. I did five this time. Cut them in fourths. Hopefully that'll go well. They are so wound up. Then ABC cookies from Aldi. Some Also some Doritos from Aldi. Nacho cheese chips. And strawberries. And then he has a milk... Everybody sounds terrible tonight. We all have allergies. And then um, his snack is some Cheez-Its and a squeeze juice. For Lucy, she has a cereal bar, some pepperoni, some animal crackers, strawberries and blueberries, nacho cheese chips, and Fruit Loops. And then she has a water to drink. So this is what everybody has. This is why I normally do voiceovers, but... You guys have been asking me to do a not voiceover one, so here you go. It's crazy, it's crazy town. This is what they're having for lunch on Thursday. We'll see you guys when they get home. Right, you guys, so today is over. Um, I ended up having to pick up Nate this morning because he was saying his stomach hurt. Since he's been home, he's been fine. So I went ahead and gave him this at lunch, and he ate, I watched him, and he ate everything. He ate the pizza bagels first, so he must really like them. And then he ate the strawberries, and then he ate um, the Doritos, and then he finished it with the cookies. So he did really good. He did drink his milk. Lucy just got home, so let's see how she did. She still has a little bit of animal crackers and a little bit of pepperoni and some fruit, but she did good too. So last day of the week coming up next. We'll see you guys on Friday. All right, you guys, so welcome to Friday. Let me show you guys what the kids have today. So for Nate, I'm trying him again with the pepperoni and cheese. If you guys remember, he used to love this like a few weeks ago. Last week when I tried it, he didn't eat it. So I don't know if we're just kind of getting burned out on it or what, but he hasn't had it in a while. So I did pepperoni and Colby Jack cheese. Hopefully he'll like it. And then he has a cereal bar, some goldfish, some strawberries, and I also gave him these nacho cheese chips. And his milk to drink with lunch. For snack today, he has a Kool-Aid Jammer and Tropical Punch and these mini alphabet cookies. For Lucy today, she has another snacky lunch. She has some ham rolls, some cucumber, <laughs> some watermelon, Cheez-Its, Honey Nut Cheerios, and some cookies. And then she always takes her water to school with her. 
So this is what they have today, and we'll see you guys when they get back, and we'll see how they did. Fingers crossed for Nate. All right, you guys, let's see how they did. I've got Mark on my hip here. So Lucy did pretty good. She still has some Cheez-It, some Cheerios, and a couple cucumbers. And Nate did not eat. I don't know if he ate any of his pepperoni and cheese. He's just kind of over it. I thought maybe he would do better today, but nope. So anyway, that's okay. Maybe we'll take a break from it for a little while. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this very easy what's for my what's in my kids lunch video. If you did, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Leave us a comment down below. Please subscribe if you're new. We'll see you all later. Bye. It's 2 a.m. and I can't fall asleep Cause I'm not tired I'm thinking about the days we